Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode 5 of season 3 <clears throat> of the Irregular Impact of High School. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, let's see what Auntie is literally about to plan because I know she's going to do something stupid because it's Auntie. Parasite on. What you gonna do? Have him compete in that night in the freaking school competition? Oh, he's so pretty. He looks like Tatsuya. In a way, I, I think you are because them clothes kind of look like you do. You mean clones? Robot clones? What the fuck? Where are we going with this show? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> gonna be like the first and last time that we see him and such because I, I, I hate when shows do that sometimes like they show a really interesting character and then they're like here you're never gonna see him again for like the hottest long time and then when you do see him again you're technically over him because he didn't get as much screen time <laughs> But if it's going to go how I think it is with the clone situation, then you're never going to see him technically at the night school competition. <laughs> oh, God. Are you okay? I'm tired. Oh. 
Oh. Well, I mean, that kind of makes... Well, see, no. One, that's a little fishy. And then two, that makes sense, especially... down and I think they just want kids to be ready for that just in case something happens like that again Okay, hold on. Let me say something real quick. What if Auntie, because like I said, Auntie, you're probably calling some weird little shots about this. What if she's the one who like convinced them to make the changes? Because I mean, th with the situation of what happened at the first nine schools, I don't know. <laughs> ah! I think now, especially like ever since I started watching this, I feel like every single adult, you got to look at it a completely different way. Anyone who has like really like, oh, good motives, you secretly have bad motives at the same time too.
Yes. I just have this feeling that like somebody's gonna get killed and, and I hate to say that but and it could be any one of these characters P weapons we talking about the clones <laughs> mm
Okay. Bye, she's so cute. But the thing is, <laughs> yeah, it can't be a date. <laughs>
It definitely would, but something still tells me it might get leaked. People have ways. And see, what if they do that at the peak of the cross-country event? Ugh. Okay. This too. All right. Now that we know what the fuck is going to happen and the fact is that our characters don't know anything, they just know, yeah, it's a little weird that they took out three events and added three new events. Like, I would be, I think if I was in this situation, of course, everybody, including myself, would be very skeptical about going into the Nine Schools competition next week. Because it, it, like, a lot of shit is about to go down. And I'm a little afraid. They're about to take these damn dolls and possibly... I'm gonna change that. I don't think no one's gonna get killed, as I was thinking. It's just a lot of people are about to get hurt next week. And the fact that some of these people are like, oh, it's okay even if my own family gets hurt. The fuck is wrong with you? And y'all just okay with this. And she's okay with this. I fucking hate her. I'm sorry. Like, I, you know what? I, I love her, but I hate her so fucking much. Like, she's such a bitch. I fucking cannot with her. Like, seriously. I, I mean... I hate a lot of, so a lot of mm, characters and such and how kind of almost deliciously evil they're portrayed and such. I mean, because, like, I think the word... Mm, you know what's her face from Don Maji, um, Who has, like, the biggest hard-on for Belle? Like, I, I like her. She's very, very cool. She hasn't got... She hasn't done anything that, uh has gotten to the point where I might dislike her and such, not only because of, you know, who her seiyuu is, but who she is as a character, because I get it. She just wants to have Belle for herself, and yes, yeah, she'll do everything in her power. I mean, that's like bad bitch move 101 and such, but at the same time, I'm over here like, yeah, how far are you trying to go to make Belle your own? And, and that's all, what kind of Ozzy is doing and, with her shit, and so that's why I'm over here like, I'm at a crossroads. Like, I, I like you. I like what you're doing, but then I hate your fucking ass. I can't stand your ass. Like, every single time when I look at you, I kind of want to punch you in the face. But no! I mean, if, if she is also, you know, having some sort of, like, situation in this, she's very sneaky about it. And of course, I mean, you know, us women, we are a little sneaky when it comes to certain things, especially if we're having a plan and we're trying to, like, let our little pieces fall as they may and such but going into next week I, I hope just like not only Tatsuya but everybody 
kind of really looks at every little thing that they do highly suspicious and very skeptical because any they're they're gonna pop off when the cross country event starts so if tatia is participating in the cross country event he's gonna be away from yuki and we all know what the fuck is gonna happen yuki's gonna get hurt I really don't want to think about that right now. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Tears episode 5 of season 3 of the Irregular Magic High School. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Enjoy the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode 6. But until then, I can... Uh, <laughs> until 